Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. Today we take a look at the newest installment on Netflix Animation, brought to you by Guillermo del Toro, Wizards, Tales of Arcadia. The Tales of Arcadia are a long animated series that started with Troll Hunters for three seasons, and then Three Below shortly after for one season, and now Wizards also for one season. All three shows are connected in the same universe and you introduce new as well as old and use the same characters that expand their story just like the Marvel Cinematic Universe did in the movie theaters. If you have not watched any of the Tales of Arcadia, I would recommend watching Troll Hunters and then Three Below before you watch Wizards as the show will expect the viewer to have some knowledge on the other series to make sense. They do their best to not let the viewer get lost, but it will happen at times. Wizards was released in August 2020 and delivers 10 episodes from about 22 to 25 minute intervals. Although short, they cram as much story and action to keep you entertained. The story and action begin quick as there is a new enemy and no one knows about who is single-handedly taking out the strongest of the Arcadian heroes. They seem to want to destroy and then rule the world. After waves of attacks, Merlin decides the only way to save their current timeline is to venture to the past. The story begins its journey with Merlin's apprentice as the main new character who will lead the charge to somehow get back to the present and save the day. The storyline is well written and it will keep you invested to each episode until its very last. There are dark themes that do occur, and this is the norm for the series, but more tragedy and redemption than any other Arcadian tales told so far. The addition of past series characters is extremely fun to see and how they interact with one another in a group similar to Marvel's Avengers is also fun to see. The action and animation are great with its original visual designs like no other than from the mind of Del Toro. The series is just getting started with a full length feature coming in 2021. With their vision, writing, and quality so far, I can't wait to see what's next for the Heroes of Arcadia. Wizards Tales of Arcadia gets an 8.5 out of 10 for its well written lore of the universe and has promptly explains all the questions you may have had from the previous series. The action is also superb and matches the quality, if not more so, in comparison. That's it for me on this episode on Beho Reviews. Please like or subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and Greg, take us out of here. Planned for a millennium, gathering, waiting. Do you mind? Sorry, it's just so fun. To undo you. Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh.